Hello and welcome to TV9 Digital. I'm Abhijit Singh Bhamra. Now on Friday, India will take on New Zealand in what would be the inaugural World Test Championship final in Southampton. A lot is at stake for both India and New Zealand who have toiled hard for over two years to be in this position. And to talk more on the final, what can happen? Are India the favourites or will Kiwis give us an upset like they did in the 2019 World Cup semi-final? I have former Indian wicketkeeper Sadanand Vishwanath with us. Sir, thanks a lot for joining us. And what are your first thoughts regarding this final? It's going to be a momentous occasion because the World Test Championship is happening after nearly two and a half years. And both New Zealand and India, the best two teams in the world, are competing against each other. Uh, sir, if I can ask you, what will be your playing eleven as far as Team India is concerned? Well, it all will depend on Virat Kohli. And uh, on that particular day, he'll have a look at the wicket and then decide whether he'll have to go in the same combination which we triumphed in Australia. Five bowlers, five batsmen and one wicket keeper. So obviously the, five, the top five batsmen pick themselves. Six will be the dashing, the sharp punt. And then you have the two quality all-rounders. You'll have Ravindra Jadija at seven, Ravichandra Ashwin at eight. And then the three bowlers, you have uh, Mahmud Shami, you have Ishan Sharma and Jasprit Bhuma. That will be my playing 11 if the wicket is a bit dry. And also, let's just quickly take a look also at the New Zealand side because you cannot take your opponents lightly, especially it's just a one test match. And to win a test match, you require 20 wickets. You had your call on India. What about New Zealand? What are the players that you look forward to or rather can rather prove to be dangerous uh, for Team India, sir? Well, the way they beat England without six of the regular players, now they've got Watling back, they've got uh, Tim Saudi back, they've got uh, the captain uh, back. And uh, yeah, Richardson. And uh, I think uh, they will play with a formidable team. They will go in with uh, four of the teamers. All the boys have done well in the test match versus England. And they'll probably look at Patel to bowl left some spin. One contest that will be on everyone's lips that is between fire versus ice. Virat Kohli versus Kane Williamson. And before uh, I take your comment, I'll just present a few numbers, uh, Mr. Vishwanath. In the last yeah. one year, since January 2020, Kane Williamson has smashed three hundreds out of those two uh, double hundreds and he averages over 83. And in the same duration, Virat Kohli's last hundred came in November 2019 against South Africa at home. And since then, his record is only averaging 24 and he has scored only 288 runs from seven matches. And guess what? The run machine, the ton maker, hasn't scored even a single hundred. So this is one contest which is likely uh, to decide the outcome. Uh, and what are your thoughts on Virat Kohli versus Kane Williamson rivalry? I think all these great players will rise to the occasion. I'm sure Virat Kohli has had a lean patch, and Kane Williamson has been doing very well over a period of time. But uh, everything starts from day tomorrow, a new yeah. day, a new game, and all these big players they rise to the occasion. So, I, I expect Virat Kohli to rise to the occasion. India's problem against the moving ball and you had uh, exponents like Trent Bolt, Tim Saudi who has taken Virat Kohli four times in uh, test matches, four or five times and also the moving ball factor that will… And mind you, you are playing in England, so that is likely to play a huge, huge role, uh, isn't it, uh, Sadaran sir? Playing in England, playing in the V, waiting for the ball to swing, not committing too early not pushing at the ball, not going hard at the ball, playing with soft hands. These are all uh, essential techniques, uh, basics that the batsmen, even the top class batsmen, will have to show in the duration of the test match. And I expect our Indian batsmen to counter the swing and the pace of the Kiwi Quick. World Test Championship final is just one test match. You either go out there, give your best and win or lose. So, how much of a pressure will that be? Obviously, pressure will be there irrespective of whether these champion players say that, you know, we are, we are immune to pressure. There will be anxiety, there will be pressure, there will be fear. But once you get out there in the middle, and you get away all those butterflies from your stomach, you start seeing the ball well, you start middling the ball well, you start feeling the entire atmosphere and feel at home. And that's when the bowlers and the batsmen and the fielders and the wicketkeeper, they all come alive. Win the toss and do what? What is your prediction uh, for the, if you're a captain, then win the toss and do what? And what would be a safe score? In cricket, there is an old adage which says, win the toss and a hundred times and bat a hundred times. So, I guess uh, if India wins the toss, they will bat first. And I think uh, anything above 300, 350, trying to consolidate and try to make a match out of it, playing session by session, 
trying to ensure that you win all those little little sessions in test cricket. Every session is a battle in test cricket, especially. So it's very, you know, if, if you have one bad session in test cricket, Abhijit, the entire battle can be lost. So it's very important. The entire war can be lost. So you have to win those mini mini battles in test cricket. And I'm sure that 350 batting first would be a formidable score. Would be a fighting score. Well, 350 is a fighting score according to Mr. Sadhana Deshwanath. Well, the countdown has begun. The clock is ticking, and with every passing second, not just the Indian cricketers but also the fans. Over a billion fans in the country have only one dream in this. in this corona virus call where where things have just gone back to worse for the country and cricket is something which can give them a lot of hope and what bigger hope than winning the wtc final against the kiwis in that too in england that could be a statement thanks a lot mr sadan and vishwanath for your comments and inputs we are looking forward to you right through the test match and all you viewers out there for all the news and updates regarding the wtc final the scores the headlines the champions who scored how much what was uh, what was the low point the high point of the day you can catch it all on tv9 and um, on that note thanks a lot for watching and take care